Chile's National Emergency Office says the latest number of casualties has risen to more than 300 following the massive earthquake that struck Saturday, and no casualties of Chinese nationals were reported. China News has more. Chilean Interior Minister Edmundo Perez Yoma says that the earthquake was a cataclysm of historical dimensions. The country has not seen a quake this size since 1960. But Perez expects the country to normalize in the next 48 to 72 hours. The Chilean housing ministry says that at least 1.5 million houses have been affected. The magnitude 8.8 tremor rocked Chile at 3:34 a.m. local time Saturday, knocking down homes and hospitals and triggering a tsunami that rolled menacingly across the Pacific. According to China's Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Sunday there have been no reports of deaths or injuries of Chinese nationals. The Chinese government says it is paying serious attention to the safety of Chinese institutions, compatriots, and students in Chile. China's State Oceanic Administration forecasts that a tsunami triggered by the quake would arrive at the coast of China at 3 to 4 p.m. Sunday, but is unlikely to cause disasters. However, the SOA warns that the wave could build up when it hits the Chinese coastline. It suggests that ships go ashore rapidly or keep away from coastal waters. And people in low-lying areas should relocate as soon as possible. Western Pacific countries such as Japan, China, the Philippines, and Indonesia could also be slightly affected by the tsunami.